walked into the Magic Kingdom and it is beautiful, beautiful today. Holy moly. Not a cloud in the sky. The temperature is perfect. It's gonna be a great day. It's the Dapper Dan's. Hey guys, this is Jenna with Resort TV One and today we're here at the Magic Kingdom and as you can tell behind me, we're gonna head into Crystal Palace. So I'm so excited. I have not been here since the pandemic, since 2019. Um, so we have a dining reservation today and um, I've got my piglet here ready to go. I don't have any, I realize I don't have any Winnie the Pooh outfits. Um, so I went with a pink theme today and I've got my awesome ears on from Kaylee, Handmade Heart Ears, um, with all the cute little food and castle and everything. So I'm excited for today. But not only do we have a dining reservation, I also got Tron for the virtual queue today. I've not got it since it opened, so cannot wait. And it's dad's first time riding. So we're gonna enjoy the day here at the Magic Kingdom. So we are here at Crystal Palace. We're a little bit early, um, so we're just gonna hang out for a little bit. But here is the menu, sort of. Lunch and dinner serving from 11 a.m. Dining reservation, you can check in right here with the QR code on your mobile device. So it is $59. It is a character dining, so it is a little bit expensive, um, but I'm excited. Have not been here since before the pandemic. So look who I brought with me today. I've got mom and dad because they're really good taste testers. And of course, they don't mind trying out some food with me today and doing the food review. I was telling them we haven't been since 2019. So we're excited to see what, you know, the food's the same, if it's different. And I can't wait to hug Piglet. <laughs> so cute. Um, but also, we have a virtual queue for Tron, and this will be Dad's first time. Are you excited? I'm excited. So excited. So we're going to enjoy our day. Can't wait. We only have a, maybe 10, 15 minutes before our reservation. So we're just hanging out here um, at the front of Crystal Palace. So here's our view on the porch of Crystal Palace. Let me zoom out. Bam. Got Casey's Corner over there a great view well kind of you can kind of see the castle underneath all the trees um, but we were watching the castle show from here which was kind of fun sounds like the piano players playing over here at Casey's so it's a great place to hang out in the shade oh, <laughs> we're excited all right we said over this way last time this is where we're at All right, this is our table. Last time we got to sit, I think, right over here against the window, which was really nice. That's okay. Uh, we'll be in the action when they do the little walk around, dance around. All right, so while we're waiting on our server, I thought I'd take you guys around and show you what there is to eat. It is buffet. So let's go check it out. So here's the kids' buffet. It's really good. I'm going to be getting some of that mac and cheese because that looks delicious. And then there's some bread. Lots of different bread options. It's like we have a pretzel roll, black pepper, parmesan, lavish, assorted dinner rolls, and then salad. Lots of salad. Pasta salad, fruit salad. Oh, peel and eat shrimp. I'm excited for these. So we have country fried chicken, mashed potatoes, green beans with onions. So here is the country fried chicken, mashed potatoes, green beans. This is grits. Ooh, dad's gonna be excited. Cheddar grits. <laughs> Ooh, there's a honey glazed salmon. Okay, I'm excited for that. There's the salmon. That looks amazing. Amazing. Uh, oven roasted chicken and Italian sausage. Those look really good as well. Red curry lentil soup. I don't know about that. Spicy. And here's the uh, prime rib and pork loin. 
Oh, it's peach chutney. That looks so good. And they have the exact same thing on the other side. So there's two sides. One side's full, you can go to the other if they're missing something. And then dessert, oh my goodness, strawberry chocolate cupcake, carrot cake, cheesecake, honey mousse cake, plant-based citrus cake, honey beef flan, and panna cotta parfait. Oh my word, this looks like Eero's tail, and that's adorable. A little honey bee on that one. And then there's soft serve, vanilla swirl and chocolate, and then we have um, apple cobbler and cookies. Also looks amazing. So here is my plate. I got the salmon, the oven roasted chicken, pretzel roll, the peel and eat shrimp, some potatoes, and some cheesy grits. They were all out of the mashed potatoes for now. I'm sure they'll get more. And mom's plate looks very similar. Yeah, she got green beans. And dad is going now. <laughs> Looks like piglets over here, so I can't wait to meet piglet. Got mini piglet ready. So far, I've had the salmon. It's really, really good. It's not spicy. It has a nice um, sweet glaze on it. The oven roasted chicken's really good as well. And the shrimp and grits. That's all, that, all I've had so far. Really, really good, but. Piglet. Piglets are behind mom. Hopefully, it comes over soon. Dad's back with his plate. It looks really good. We got a dinner roll. About the same thing we did. Looks delicious. Tigger, here he comes. Hi, Tigger. <laughs> Hi, Eeyore. How, how's your day? Uh, okay. Well, I hope we, we made it a little better because we love you. Oh, good. I'm so glad. Oh, thank you, Eeyore. Thank you. T-I double go. Er, it's Tigger. <laughs> you know what Tiggers like to do best? That's it. You got it. <laughs> oh, we love you, Tigger. Oh, <laughs> Bye, Tigger. Winnie the Pooh's up next. Can't wait. How are you today? You're doing good. Uh, oh, rumbly in your tummy. I know, I know. I did too, that's why we came here. I took some of mom's prime rib because she had quite a bit. Got some mac and cheese and more cheesy grits. Um, and then next will be dessert. Can't wait. Okay, I'm gonna try to eat left handed. Mm. Try the prime rib. Mm. Nice and tender. The mac and cheese is good. The grits are really good. And those um, the little round potatoes, super good. Okay, so we're looking out for Piglet because he was meeting and greeting um, after we got there. So we missed Piglet. He's my fave. So I've been keeping an eye out. I'm gonna hustle back to the table if we see him. But I, oh, there he is. Okay, he's right here. So if he goes to, um, over to our table, I'm gonna hustle back. But it's dessert time and I'm excited. 
Yeah, I'm gonna get the cobbler sometime, but I'm gonna get, oh, they're out of the bee treat. I'm gonna get one of each though, so I can try them for you guys, and for me, of course. All right, so here is my dessert plate, and it looks amazing. I'm gonna try all these. There was one that wasn't there, it was the honey bee one, which is really good, so I'm gonna have to go back for that. And probably some apple cobbler and ice cream. I saved room, so we're all good. Mom, what do you think of your apple cobbler? Eh? You didn't like it? Oh, it's that's not sweet sad. enough. Oh, that's why you add ice cream. Oh yeah, or sugar. Well, there's sugar right here, Mom. Yeah, I am. <laughs> and what's not that? a fan. What not a that? fan. Oh, good. I think he's coming this way. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I'm not gonna eat anything until he comes. Piglet! Guess what? You are my absolute favorite. Look who I brought. It's Minnie Piglet! <laughs> Aww, so cute! Spirit Jersey, you need one of those, right? We should, you wanna go shopping? Let's go get you one. Let's do it. Um, okay, picture with mom and dad. All right, let's try some of the desserts now that we got to hug Piglet. <laughs> Um, citrusy, citrusy. You are one. It has some sort of citrus in it. But this one, I think, I think this one's one of these is plant based. I think it's this one. It's very loosey. Looks like Mickey Mouse. Oh no, Winnie, Winnie the Pooh. For me but yeah out of all of them I think that one was my favorite all really good though even this one it looks funny and the consistency is weird but it tastes really good all right so I look back at all the names of everything this is a strawberry chocolate um, cupcake since there's a little bit of chocolate in the middle there but it's good I think this one is the plant-based one because it was a citrus and this might be the honey one. There was also a honey flan, which they didn't have up there at the time when we went. Yeah. All right, so here is Dad's dessert plate. And he got the other one, the honey bee flan. We also got some ice cream. I'm gonna go back for some soft serve too. Yummy. Okay, here's my last dessert. So I got a little bit of the cobbler, some vanilla soft serve, and a chocolate chip cookie. Yum, yum, I'm getting really full though. Um, this is the other side of the restaurant that we've never sat on, that I can remember. And then we 
got Winnie the Pooh and Eeyore over here being so cute. So we just got done with Crystal Palace and it was delicious. Um, it was a lot of fun seeing the characters. What'd you guys think? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. The characters were just awesome. Oh, food characters were great. Yeah. yeah. Characters were probably my favorite. Yes. Yeah. But yeah. food was good too. That's what yeah. really makes it special. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. And you get you get the one on one. You don't have to wait in line to, to meet them, which is amazing. And they're very good at coming up and taking a picture with you. Yep. Them, you know? They spend time with each table. Yeah. Sounds like the band's coming. Um, I would say Liberty Tree. Um, I like their food better. But the food here was, it was good. I love the salmon, the peel and eat shrimp was good, uh, prime rib. Cheesy grits were real good. Yeah, those were good. Yeah, yeah. Food was good. What was your favorite? Good. Uh, I say the salmon. Yeah, that was really good. And the desserts, they had a whole array of desserts, something for everybody, and even chocolate chip cookies and ice cream, so yes. can't go wrong. It was really good. Go hungry if you're going there. <laughs> yeah, definitely go hungry and you will not leave hungry, that's for sure. <laughs> the umbrella beautiful breeze listening to the show the castle show over here um, and we checked our virtual queue for Tron and Tron is down at the moment so they're not boarding hopefully they'll fix it so we can ride later well we popped into the shop and found some new munchlings milk chocolate marshmallow s'mores and this one you can actually eat the others are not edible but this one is a grand crackers and marshmallow covered with milk chocolate does not have a price but that's pretty cool, really interesting. And they have a giant Baymax s'more, holy bully. This is cool. He's so cute. They also have um, a little notebook here for the Munchling series for $19.99. And then of course they have all of the um, ornaments here and the pin set, which is so cute. The pin set is $29.99 for four. They also have a Chip and Dale pillow. One side is Chip, one side is Dale. And it smells, it smells good. I think it's chocolate. It's hard to tell, but it's $39.99. They also have a throw blanket. This is what it looks like on one side. And this is the other side. I see a price on it. Oh, here we go, $59.99. We're making our way into Tomorrowland. Of course we have to say hi to Stitchy as we pass by. See if he's gonna talk to us today. Happy to meet you, friend. Be Aww. happy too. Aww, I love you, Stitchy. Oh, this is happy, smiley place. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. So, of course, we have to go on People Mover. It was only about a 20 minute wait, and everything else was pretty long. So, it's People Mover time, guys. So, we're on the People Mover, and look who I'm with. Enjoy it's Nikki! We're gonna ride the People Mover! So excited! Beautiful, beautiful day for the People Mover. Galactic Travelers, welcome aboard the People Mover, presented by Enterprise. I'm Morak 5, and we're guided aboard this highway in the sky. The absolute best way to see tomorrow. And my stars, there are ever lots to see. From spacecraft to monster lands, there's really nothing like today in tomorrow. Now on 
approaching Tomorrowland Transit Authority Station. My fellow sentient life forms, people move our journey has nearly come full orbit. Thanks for riding with us. It's been a pleasure to have you aboard. And even though we're concluding, this is always my favorite part. Because now is the time, now is the best time to go out and explore tomorrow, today. See you in the future. Ah, <laughs> we love you so much. We're your biggest fans, biggest fans. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I think he's your biggest fan. <laughs> Not that tattoo, but okay. So Tron is back open again, uh, which you could tell while we were on the people mover. But they are on number 60, 488, so we're getting there, and it is 319 for reference. All right, guys, we're going on Peter Pan. I'm so excited! I love this ride. Hello, Peter Pan. Hello, Peter Pan. Boarding group 85, we're 88, so we thought, hey, let's just start walking over this way. Um, but yeah, they haven't called us quite yet. Hopefully soon. And just for reference, it's 547. But they were down uh, during the day for a little bit. So they're running a little slower. So excited. I haven't ridden this since the media preview. They're still on group 85, but we'll probably come up here, use the nice Tron bathrooms before we have to wait in line. Because I heard you can wait for a while. Uh, it was media, so we didn't have to wait like at all. And before that was annual pass holder. We didn't have to wait much for that either. So, we'll see how long it is. So we're still outside. We're almost to right here where you get in line either for lightning lane or regular queue. Of course, we're in regular queue. They've already called group 90. So we got to scan our vans up here. But it's been about... Here. Here we go, Team Blue. Team Blue. Alright, we're going in the hallway. It's about 20 minutes. So for now, we're stopping. Wasn't that cool? 
We barely got made it in that room. It was too squishy, but we made it. So I didn't get to show you guys, but you know what that room looks like. It's super cool. So let's wait. I think the car, one of the cars should be coming. It's very fingerprinty. <laughs> checking out Crystal Palace. That was a lot of fun. Really, really good. Glad we got to go back again. And um, Dad's first time on Tron. That was a lot of fun too. And um, of course, the other rides we got to ride today, Peter Pan and People Mover. So it's been a fun day and we're here until later than we thought because of Tron. It's eight o'clock. <laughs> it's been a long day, but a fun day. So hope you guys enjoy coming along and uh, having all the fun with us today. Leave us a comment down below um, if you've ever been to Crystal Palace or if you're excited to come the next time you're here. And we'll see you guys soon. Check out all of our sponsors. Links are down below in the description of the video. See you next time. So for now, have a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. And check out our sponsors, MickeyBlog.com and MickeyTravels.com for the best in free vacation planning advice. Check out MickeyTravels.com to book your next trip to Disney. Also, if you're thinking about moving to Central Florida to be closer to the magic, the team at Resort TV One Homes, brokered by EXP Realty and in partnership with the Funk Collection, would love to make your dreams come true. Go to ResortTV1Homes.com and fill out the contact form for more info. And if you would like to treat your family to a stay at a Disney Deluxe Villa for a fraction of the cost, go check out David's Vacation Club Rentals at dvcrequest.com slash tv. Now that you've finished watching this video, be sure that you're subscribed so that you can get all of the latest updates. Also, check out some other great videos on our channel. Have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye bye